friend asked if I could 3D print something to hold this kind of bee feeder lid. The way this works is uh, you take a jar with this lid with the holes and bees can feed the bottom, but you need a way to hold this on top of the hive so it didn't fall off. So I started out by using uh, some software called Tinkercad to try and design the first one like this. Let's just see what it'd be like. I'm still learning to use this program. And once you have the 3D design, you I bring it into Prusa Slicer and uh, uh, so I can 3D print it to make the code that makes the printer go. Well, this is the first print. Um, the lid is, you know, the opening's too small and then it's just way too thick. So I'm gonna do another version um, to make it wider opening and thinner here. This is the second version I made. You can see uh, this is much thinner, uh, much nicer, um, but the opening is just a little bit too small. So I have to go for version three. See if third time is the charm. This is version three, and uh, the initial test is uh, it fits perfectly. So let's try it with a jar on it. So to show you how this is supposed to work, this is what we call a migratory cover in beekeeping. It's wood, and when they want to feed them, they cut a hole in the top, the bees come up from the underside to feed. So with this thing, that would get screwed in with these holes to the, over the hole. And then you would take your feeder jar full of sugar syrup and stick it right in there. And the goal is he can just change out the feeder jars as he needs um, without having to worry about it tipping over and uh, falling over, which is what happens from time to time. So uh, neat, neat learning experience for me. Hopefully it works out for him. If you want to make it yourself, I've uploaded to Thingiverse. You search on bee feeder jar holder and then you will find it. Uh, hope it works out for you. Thank you.